Hey YouTubers, I have my food. Of course you could tell by the name of it down there. Let's look at scripture cake. This is what it looks like. Now let's just have us a bite and see if we like it. Raisins are good. Hmm. Not that bad at all. Hmm. Well, let's get busy and let's just give you the recipe. It's scripture cake. Hmm. It's kind of heavy, I can tell you that. First, we want two cups and we want to go to Judges. Mm -mm. Judges 5 and we want 25 Blessed above women shall Jezreel the wife of Hermer the cannot be Blessed shall but she be above women Wait a minute Judges 5 Oh Gotta go down one he asked her water, and she gave him milk. She brought forth butter in a lordly dish. All right, now it's two cups of milk. Okay, so now we want to go to Exodus 29. Exodus 29. And we want... Two, and unleavened bread and cakes, unleavened tempered with oil and wafers, unleavened anointed with oil, of wheaten flour shalt thou make them. So we want three and a half cups of flour. Let's go to Jeremiah. Uh, if I can get it to go there. Jeremiah. And we want six. Jeremiah six and twenty. To what purpose cometh there to me incense from Sheba and the sweet cane from a far country? Your burnt offerings are not acceptable, nor your sacrifice sweet unto me. So we're talking about sugar, and we want one and a half cup of sugar. Okay, we want to go to First Samuel. First Samuel, and we want thirty and twelve. And they gave him a piece of a cake of figs and two clusters of raisins. And when he had eaten, his spirit became again to him. For he had eaten no bread, nor drank any water three days and three nights. I used raisins. And I used, I used two cups. But I think, if you like a lot of raisins, two cups will work. I think one cup would work too, or maybe one and a half. Um, let's go to Isaiah, and we want ten. Um, Isaiah ten and fourteen. And my hand hath found as a nest the riches of the people, and as one gathers eggs that are left. Have I gathered all the earth, and there was none that moved the wing, or opened the mouth, or peeped. And I used three eggs. Okay, now this one is optional. Leviticus. Well, if I can get it. Leviticus 2. The 
Leviticus 2 and 13. And every oblation of thy meat offering shall season with salt. Neither shalt thou suffer the salt of the covenant of thy God to be light from thy meat offering. With all thy offering thou shalt offer salt. It's optional. I'm going to tell you, I didn't use salt because my mom has high blood pressure. And I don't want to mess with her high blood pressure, so I don't cook with salt. I have salt here, so if people want salt, then they can have salt. But I don't, I don't salt nothing. Alright, let's go to 1 Samuel. And we want 4... And we want 25. 1 Samuel 4. And there's no 25. Let me go check and find out which one it is. Be right back. Sorry about that, Chief. It's 1425. So let's move along over here to 14. And we want 25. <clears throat> and all they of the land came to a wood, and there was honey upon the ground. And you want two tablespoons of honey. And we want uh, to go back to Judges 4. Judges 4 and 19. And he said unto her, Give me, I pray thee, a little water to drink, for I am thirsty. And she opened a bottle of milk and gave him drink and covered him. You want a half a cup of water. Now, um, I baked it at 350 for 45 minutes until the brown was on top of it. And... Let's just have us another good old taste of it. Because now this is good. Mmm. Well, YouTubers, y'all try it. It's really good. I love you guys. Bye.